Hello everybody and welcome to my stream. I'm Alleged Man and tonight, 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 we're going to be doing uh, more adventures of uh, Catboy with a Stick in Final Fantasy XIV. Um, so yeah, tonight uh, we left off uh, getting ready for a rescue mission of the Science of the Seventh Dawn. And yeah, we're going to go rescue our NPC friends and uh, hopefully have a good time doing it and uh, maybe get a dungeon raid uh, or two in. So... Yeah, that's what we're doing tonight, and uh, gonna continue the MS, uh, the main story quest. So, yeah, uh, we're partially through a realm reborn, so we we might do Heaven's Word, or we might not, uh, depending on how things are. So, yeah, um, as far as the rest of the schedule goes, um, tonight's Final Fantasy fourteen, of course, and Sunday is gonna be our community Jackbox night, um, where I play uh, Jackbox with all of you. And, um, yeah, we get to have fun with that. So, um, as far as news goes, uh, I did a job interview today, so uh, we'll, we'll find out next week if I, if I have another, uh, if I have a second interview or a, uh, or the job uh, right on hand. So we'll find out. So, um, still doing the skateboard giveaway. Um, we got games in the pipeline going on, and we got my stream anniversary coming up uh, in August. Uh, 22nd, where we're going to play uh, Cards Against Humanity with a bunch of other streamers, and we're going to have fun with that. So, um, without further ado, we are going to get right into Final Fantasy. So, uh, let's jump right in. And yes, uh, as I said before, I am on the uh, Balmung server. It's the, uh, at, at the time I did not know what the server was, and then I found out it was the uh, the adult-oriented um, roleplay server. So, yeah. So we're gonna try to avoid that much as possible, and um, you know, all the all the dirty, uh, all the dirty kinky things. So yeah, we'll uh, we'll go from there. And um, yeah, all right. Let's get into it. There we go. Okay. Data center, there we go. There we go, okay. Well, like I said last time, uh, in the main story, we were mounting a rescue for our friends, and oh my god, I forgot I look like, uh, forgot I look like, uh, Link from Legend of Zelda with a, uh, iron, iron face helmet on, so yeah. Um, level 47, and yeah, so... Again, we're rescuing our NPC friends from uh, from the evil empire in their in their uh, fortress called Castrum Century. So we're mounting that uh, rescue. Okay, just gotta wait a few minutes and then uh, we'll be in. Yeah, <sighs> yeah, that's what's going on in the game. Um, I don't know if I, I think I need a new spear though. Uh, the spear's not doing uh, as much damage as I think it should be. So we'll, we might we might go back to Gridania, and yeah, and pick up a uh, pick up a new uh, new spear. We'll find out. Okay, so I think we're in Revenant's Toll, is where we last left off. Uh, we'll find out where I am in a second. Yeah, yeah, okay. Yeah, we're at Revenant's Toll. And yeah, this is where we left off. Oh. There, there's my guy, Tiny Bear, uh, looking like Link with a spear. Uh, but okay. Uh, you know what? Just out of curiosity, let's let's go to go back to Gridania and get a new spear if we can.
Okay. Let's see if we can get a new spear. We'll find out. So we are level 47. And we got we got plenty of money. We should be we should be okay for uh uh things. Ah, hang on. person. Okay, uh... Battlecraft supplier, okay, that's weird. First weapons, Okay, so, yep. Uh... Cobalt Trident Lance. Yeah! Okay. Also, nope. I gotta look at all the stuff I got here. Uh, high potion of mind, intelligence, med Okay, hang on, let's see if I can... Let's just do that, and then, yeah. Alright, let's... 
I'll just teleport to... Uh, yeah, right this hole. Okay. Alright, now we're gonna continue on with the mission. Just wanted to go get a new lance. Here's where we needed to go. Okay. And Sid requires your assistance for his rescue preparation. Okay. Well, Glam out. Uh, Glam on. It goes about devising his plan. We need to see some preparation of our own. Okay. It wouldn't do. If, it wouldn't do if the Imperials were to discover their uh, short on ar short in armor. Uh, Prevent this from happening. I'm gonna uh, try to put together a makeshift communications jamming device. The explanation is, is like to get a bit technical, so bear with me. Uh, Imperial forces communicate via electromagnetic waves. Simply put, voices are, are born upon uh, etheric uh, lightning energy that permeates the air. Uh, now, this hillside's cluster of corrupted crystals uh, to the west has been observed to amplify that self same energy. By making uh, use of this property, we should be able to uh, drown out Imperial voices. To ensure we have enough amplification, uh, we must identify most of the uh, potent crystals among this cluster for this. I need you to go there and use this device to take readings. I'll, I'll, write the light, um, I'll mark the likely places of your map. Oh, and just so you know, uh, plasmoids are, uh, are drawn to lightning. Don't be surprised if you run into it with you. Okay. We need to go. This way. And of course my chocobo is going super duper slow. Please do not notice me. Please do not notice me. Oh wait, no, no. I'm supposed, to, supposed to go this way. Okay. Ah, there's one of them right now. Okay, so I gotta find five places to uh, check out this certain uh, uh, Okay, here we go. Okay. Uh, actually, I think there's another one just right here. Oh great, within... Yeah. Okay, let's go around here and 
Okay, there's one up there. Oh, and I have to fight this this dork. Hey, buddy! You're interrupting my uh, scientific research here. Oh shit. Okay. Dang it! Okay. Son of a bitch. Ah, uh, alright. Now I gotta go with friggin' money and go all the way back. Damn it. Alright. But I got enough money. Uh, for a free account. Uh, uh or in-game currency, I should say. Alright. Go back and you know what? Here's what we're going to do. Okay, that was good. Uh, 
Thank you, Chocobo, for a little bit of a distraction. Uh, now let's see. Uh, let's get rid of you first, because I know what you're going to do. Install this sort of thing and okay, that's cool. Don't want to mess with me. Okay, good. Good news for me. Oh, it's up there. Okay. I see what they want now. Okay. Gotta go. Somehow we gotta get up there. I don't know how we're gonna do... Oh, right there. Okay. Right here. slow alright <laughs> Harley Davidson bro <laughs> That was weird. You see, you see a motorcycle just come out of nowhere and be like, hey -o! <laughs> Yeah, the reading's excellent. Here, let me see the numbers. Okay. Yes, before these crystals should suit our purpose, though I pray that we won't ha have need of their power. My thanks, Tiny. Century. The tunnel contains immense manufacturing parts facilities, and it is the primary supplier of material for throughout the university. Consequently, it is heavily defended, infiltrating it will not be easy, and the less than is necessary. Okay. Did what? Uh, stealth and stuff. Okay. Fuck him. 
Okay, oh boy, I always wanted my own Reaper. No washer and waxer and namer and yeah. Okay. Uh dress number of soldiers and sneaking in the front door, eh? Well, you got you got the guts to go through with it, so do I. Okay. Uh we've gotta talk to somebody nearby. Whoa! Oh, oh yeah, this guy. Uh, Glamon. Yeah. He's the person we have to talk to. Uh, Glamon wants you to practice the part of an Imperial Trooper. Uh, clean the wax out of your ears now, because there's something I, I want you to do, by the way. By way of preparation. Uh, plus, to have you enter Casting Sentry, I'll deck out an Imperial Duds, but her disguise is more than just clothes and, and what you're wearing. You gotta also act the part, right? At the very least, you need to know uh, how to perform a convincing Imperial salute and first impressions of everything, as they say. Uh, I could teach you to salute myself, of course, but it's best you learned it from experts, so uh, get yourself near as, uh, near as you dig and watch the Imperials doing what they do. Jeez, okay. It'll be a long ride, but okay. Here we go. Turn the other way. Yep, don't look at me. Stupid giant frog things. Oh, got something. Wait a second. Okay. That and okay, let's get back in the fight.
Got it. Okay. All right, here we go. Hutsing. We just killed a bunch of Imperial soldiers just to look at how they salute. Okay. That makes sense. Nothing to report, sir. Uh, I received the anonymous warning that in, uh, insurgent forces are near. Yeah, we just took the, we just took four of them out or three. Let's redo our vigilance. I should recommend the patrols be increased. Be on the lookout for a guy who looks like Link. Legend of Zelda, and he's got a metal face mask. That's a cool looking chocobo. Uh, uh, no, no, no. Guess you don't demonstrate. I'm a liability to fly into a rage and crack skulls. Let's take your word for it. You learned the Imperial salute. <laughs> okay. Okay, uh, Sark and Lark wishes to help you acquire the disguise you need to risk for your rescue mission. Okay. Uh, you're called Tiny Bear, yes? Uh, I hear, I uh, hear your plight from my friend Glamont, uh, as a fellow adventurer and son of yours. You both, I would offer you my assistance. In order to infiltrate Castle Century, you and your comrades must disguise yourselves as Imperial soldiers. The question is, how to go out about acquiring uniforms and helms? Uh, there are places that man might purchase them, but individuals who deal in such wares are... Secrets. Uh, more prudent, I believe, to procure them via traditional means from the bodies of their recently deceased owners. Fortified area of forecast for century never lacks uh, for Imperial patrols. I to look to obtain three sets of gear, one for each member of the infantry, Biggs Wedge, and yourself. When you, uh, when you have what you need, please return and allow me to inspect the spoils. Okay. We have to go... Yeah, over here. Okay. Alright. Back on the Chocobo and let's ride! Very, very slowly for some weird reason. Is there any other crystal that we can go? Okay, no. Okay. All right. Oh, that's a big drop. Okay. How's everybody doing today? Want to avoid the big giant toad frog things? Because if they see you, they're not going to have a good time. And it's a waste of your time as well. The other way. Yo. Well, shit. Okay.
get him. Hex his freaking face off your... <laughs> Alright. Let's take out this individual over here. Out. Not, really a, not really a huge problem. Okay, I gotta sit and rush for a bit. Okay. Woo! Alright, get my health back. Okay. Okay. And one for good measure. Got him. Okay. What do you say we, uh, ah. some crew equipment. Okay. Damage is suspected in the present years. I fear these uniforms are in Helm's Rift. Might draw suspicion. Most are repaired in Helm's officially. Uh, fortunately, Bex is uh, eagin' off at the Diamond Forge and Rowena's house of Splendor should be able to hammer them in shape in no time. Uh, I've already sent the word ahead and have been assured that he's expecting you. We're not, we've already, um, uh, postponed on the need for more secrecy. Yep. We go this way. And we talk to, uh, Eganolf. I guess we go inside and go upstairs. Yeah. Ah, oh, right here. Okay. 
So you're the adventurer, uh, so the adventurer's, uh, Sark Malark. <laughs> then, are you? Uh, I've been waiting for you. Now let's see what you got for me. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I guess I can bring around and have these back into shape for you. Uh, after all, I owe your friend Sark Malark a favor or two. Could have taken care of all you know back in the day, or done all the reading he did. Uh, did you know he's the son of the uh, Welsh's families in the uh, Sultanate? Wouldn't expect uh, someone like that to end up in a life like he did, uh, but I suppose he's always felt adventure's life calling him. Uh, but here I go blabbering about uh, when there's work to be done. Just hold on to your uh, horse birds for a moment or two, and the great Egan off will have your gear and look as good as new. Awesome. Awesome, thank you, buddy. Some time passes. And there you have it. Won't do much good in battle, mind you, but uh, from what I hear, uh, it's not your priority, anyhow. Uh, do send Sark more like my regards, will you? <laughs> Alright. All right. Go back. Hmm. All right. Yeah, have you returned the uniforms? Homes are repaired. Okay. Uh, yes, he still served beautifully. The great Eganoff never fails to impress the. Uh, one of these repairs uh, would even fool the criminal gates. This equipped, you should not have any trouble uh, blending them amongst the real force. Unless you fear for the Garleans, might detect uh, foreigners' uh, foreignness. Foreigners, in fact, form greater for the Garlean invasion force than Eorzea. Uh, you see, when the Empire subjugates new territory, it assimilates the people of that land and the armed forces. In turn, the, and these conscripted forces subjugate uh, faraway lands. This way, uh, Garlemud nips rebellion in the bud and expands his territory in one fell stroke. With that, my partner mission is done. I am full glad to been of assistance to your cause. Uh, hmm. Why would I, worth the merchant, uh, wish to help you? I know not where you heard such a tale, but believe me when I say I am but another humble adventurer. One who, <laughs> one who desire to only act in the best interest of the realm. Okay. Uh, Lamont has finally uh, devised the plan and appropriate the uh, suit of magic tech armor. Uh, good work getting the Imperial duds. You'll be pleased to hear uh, I have been idle myself. It took me uh, long enough, but I finally hashed the plan to get us a suit of magic tech armor. Now, uh, from what I've seen, Castle Century deploys uh, a Reaper for most of its patrols. Uh, the trouble is the patrols, uh, patrols themselves are regular, regular meeting random routes, random deployments, and hardly any of them uh, come anywhere near Remnant's toll. Uh, so, hoping to coax the Imperial out of their shells, uh, to the liberty of feeding them a bit of old false, uh, false intelligence told them the told them insurgents had designs on their stronghold. Ain't far from the truth now I come to think of it. Any road, we should start uh, seeing more patrols than we have up, up until now. Uh, what you need to do is approach these patrols dressed in your uh, Fanny tin suit and alert them, uh, the uh, alert them to the enemy's presence. Uh, having done that, you'll want to learn near Revan's tall as you can. Like as not, they'll be weary of venturing far from their own walls. Uh, if they do need an expert to encourage it, use the smoke signal. Uh, those fresh from the uh, Imperial Scout. From an Imperial Scout. They'll come run in when they see the, uh, and they'll arrive the cavalry arrives and you hit them hard and make off with their Reaper. What was that? Uh, I ain't mistaken, these patrols sweep them for right now, so run along and don't forget to salute. Uh. Where is the emote? Emotes right here. Okay. 
Okay, there's the Imperial Suit. I'm going to put it right there. Uh, okay, and off we go. Alrighty. Time to go make some fake salutes and whatnot. Is that a guy riding a big polar bear? Yeah. Hey buddy, did you give him a coke? Okay. right off and oh damn it okay <laughs> oh you asshole God damn it! Hi. Uh, carry on, sir. Sir, just give an easy say. Did you make your description there? Very well beyond our perimeter, but I will not uh, say I much for miss. You're turning the scene. Keep an eye on those insurgents. Uh, should things go right, use your smoke and will call us. Okay. Now. Stupid big fat lizard things. 
Stupid big fat toads. Can they just leave me alone? Okay. Okay. Do I have to go up here again? I think I do. Yeah, I do. Okay. Yeah. Okay. I know my major unseen is we're seizing the advantage of weaponry. I thought I'd be best on hand. Yep. Ah, there she is. This is the place. Where's the enemy? Uh, sir, over there! Send in the Reaper. Let's make an example of these insurgents. Yep. Okay, here we go! Oh shit. Get out of the way. Yeah. There we go. There we go. Got it. <laughs> Sid almost died. Last of Arrow and Suited Magic Armor. Nice. Hmm. Not wishing to look the like, eh, chokeable gift in the beak, it does seem rather worse for wear, doesn't it? Biggs Wedge, what's your honest assessment? Oh, this effect's, uh, this effect she's smoking, of course. But looking past that, I say she's struck with sound. Nice! Hmm, I don't like the, mm, I don't like the way these legs are buckled, I hate to say this, but, uh, servo, servo mechanism may be damaged. 
Uh, those things are protected by uh, Olympic armor plate. Uh, they are, yes. It's odd. Uh, the casing doesn't seem to have taken a blow. I suspect we're dealing with uh, faulty parts. Uh, well, whatever it is we're dealing with, we're not resting until we're fixed. Not when we go sleep. You got that wedge? <laughs> oh, mumble, uh, heart chocobo. I heard that. A hall has been set aside for us soon for using Revenant's toll. Uh, that's where we carry out repairs. Look for us there, Tiny. <laughs> I look dumb with that helmet. Woo! That is a very cool uh, little uh, cutscene there. Also, do not toss any dwarves. Oh, that thing is limping bad. And I think I'm gonna get that as a mount. I've seen somebody use those earlier. Well, earlier, earlier in another session, I should say. All right. All right, Slaff. How you doing? I'm actually gonna sit in uh, sit the other good side, going and join them. Sig Sid's workshop, sure. Closer to our plenary is especially sound, but there's several mechanisms faulty. We needn't worry though, Biggs and Wedge will uh, we'll see her restored to her former glory and no time at all. Give those two things to mend, and they will uh, not else get the job done. It is a marvelous thing to behold, provided you remind them uh, to visit the privy. Yeah. My weapon call. Now I'm level 48. I already got one, thank you very much. Okay, onward. Did it have you assist in the repairs of the magistratic armor? Of course. Repairs are proceeding in pace, uh, but it wouldn't be long before Pigeon Way is complete the work. No problem. Mirror called and uh, Machina's servo mechanism was discovered uh, to be faulty. Uh, Wedge was subsequently ascertained to the magic of reports and derising. This uh, card's rather fragile device, it must be replaced at regular intervals uh, thanks to the magic. However, uh, the one using this repair is long overdue. Last, we do not have access to the participant here in Dono, but all is not lost. Wedge thinks he may have identified all the Go and see him, would you? I uh, have all the details to you. Yep. No. Ah! <laughs> Silly bunny, get out of here. Okay, here we go. Uh, as I believe the chief was already in front of beyond use. Uh, when placement. Uh, I thought about having an appropriate uh, more reefers, but even if the uh, dinner had a maintenance engineer in the castle century had remembered to replace the record, we would have uh, imperial suspicion. Okay. But do not, do not despair. I do believe there is a solution. I substitute the magic core core uh, with a mammoth heart. Uh, in case you didn't know, a mammoth heart can be used to grant sentience to an automaton. By my reckoning, such a device would be more incapable of regulating. Uh, we'll just make need to make uh, some minor, uh, minor modifications to the housing unit. Uh, I've already placed an order 
I have the first mammoth heart with the uh, goldsmith skills. All that remains is for you to go to Old Dawn and collect it. Oh, eh, and pay for it. Ahem. Did I mention how much they cost? No, well, they typically cost something on the order of. Mm -hmm. Um, I hope. You don't mind footing the bill, it's for a good cause. Okay. So let us go to Ulda. And, uh, yeah. Let us travel to Ulda. Uh, let's go, let us fly. Okay. We're going to Ulda. Okay, good. We're making progress. Hmm. Okay, now we need to find the Goldsmith's Guild. Whatever that may be. Um, Goldsmith's Guild, yep. Okay, awesome. Not to worry, I have plenty of money to uh, foot the bill for this, I hope. Hello there, come to collect the mammoth heart, you say? Then you must be on half the uh, Garland Ironworks. Uh, I've taken liberty of the final example we have. A heart for, for Prince Among Mammoths. Uh, payment? Oh, that won't be necessary. The heart's for Master Alphano's personal use. After all, he notified us a short while ago uh, that his manservant would be coming to collect it. Uh, tender and years though he may be, Master Alphano's uh, has such a back for my predecessors. Close and skill wouldn't dream of cha charging him. Uh, but here's the Mammoth Heart. May it serve you well. Oh, I'm pleased to pass on the comments to your master. Okay. Um. Gotta go back to Revenant's Toll. Okay. I go in, hardly need saying, but yeah. Okay, cool. We're gonna rescue our friends. Uh, you have the memory heart? Okay. Alrighty. Ah, thank you so much. Yes, uh, this is magnificent! Must have cost an, empire, an emperor's ransom. Mm -hmm. Free of charge, courtesy of Alphano. Uh, <laughs> coming from an infill financial, it certainly has its advantages. But without further ado, let's give it a try. I've already modified uh, the housing unit, and so it should slot right in. <laughs> Bang, bang. It doesn't fit the housing unit. <laughs> There, she's ready. Magitek armor, engage! Uh, or not, haha. <laughs> Just needs a love and tap, I'll wager. There we go! Yes, she's alive! SHE'S ALIVE! Uh, let's take her outside and put her through her pace, Tanya. Would you care to do the honors? Okay. Okay. Up into the pilot seat and we'll begin as soon as you're ready. Uh, first, I'd like to try climbing the uh, tangle of crystals yonder, as far as up you can go, if you please. Uh, oh, if for some reason you need to dismount and simply come back here, and we'll start again.
Okay. Okay, I'm in a big giant mech. We're playing Mech Warrior. Eh, yeah, just kidding. Uh, for me to like good now uh, jump back down here uh, and then sprint uh, north as quick as you can Come on. Okay. Oh, hang on. We were supposed to go the other way. Oops. Okay. All right. Big walking mech coming through. Big giant mech coming through. Just a really impeccable incident. Excellent. Who's making your way back? Okay. Okay. Uh, the means to this. That's it. Excellent, and that concludes our test. Thank you for your cooperation. Okay. Uh, here's the summary of findings. Uh, the drivetrain is in sound condition with some fine tuning. Uh, we can expect a noticeable improvement in performance as a mechanism. Uh, I'm afraid it's already nearly as fun as it should be in a kind of loss. And why the memory heart is, should be spelled correctly, uh, perhaps the inner workings of different operate uh, harmoniously with the uh, armor's other mechanisms. Okay. Uh, whereas Magitech cores uh, serve only as conduct impulses, mammoth hearts enable automata to process the information collected by their sensors as, as feeling gas feelings. Uh, maybe we should just uh, feel like she's part of the team. Uh, in which case, we should all do our part to make her best feel welcome. Okay, uh, oh yeah. Okay. Click. Okay. Log window. <laughs> Everything she does is magic tech, hey? Everything she does is magic. <laughs> Every little thing she does is bad. Yeah, after as it fell, I give my best. I'd feel welcome, bloody, uh, feel bloody standstill. What were you expecting to do? 
Uh, with security? Uh, currency? Yeah. They don't make them like they used to. Uh, I'm just kidding. Uh, no doubt you're wondering why the server making is so important as, as to warrant the silliness. Without it, uh, the pilot would try to control every movement manually. This would uh, be an onerous task. The best of times and holy uh, practical during battle. Uh, using a man to place a uh, worn magitech core seemed uh, promising to less the device does not appear no garling technology. Which other noise uh, demonstrated appreciation to our friend here? Uh, I'm at my wits end, Chief. She just doesn't seem convinced. We could try a little dance, perhaps, or cheer our heads off. Uh, Imperials, they've come for the armor. Oh no! Damn it, they have it cornered. There's the Reaper. Thing about your garland in the uh, Eakin Slayer, all oh, bullocks. <laughs> all for reinforcements. The hell's you will. <laughs> Locked the kitchen and repressing the instant. Respond, respond. Uh, it's no use, sir. There's some sort of interference. Curse you, Garland! No matter. We can't reclaim it, destroy it. Uh, bloody hells, honey, protecting armor at all costs. Okay. Got it. All right. Cool. 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 Woo! <laughs> huh? Whoa! <laughs> like Terminator vision, almost. Chief, look, she moved. 
Now she designs to grace us with her presence. It took us a good while, but we're finally ready. Uh, tend to infiltrate uh, Castle Gentry and rescue our comrades. There, the finishing touch. <laughs> nice little graffiti work. <laughs> All right. Uh, the server mechanism is now fully functional, and all it took was a simple fight to the death room. I do not install that man hard aboard a Enterprise, which, as much as I love her, <laughs> I would not rather have, not be required to uh, profess uh, profess it before boarding. But enough of that. Let's let's see to our final uh, preparations. Uh, thanks to Vixen Webs, the Reaper is now as good as new. We are as prepared as we'd look likely to get. Okay, let's continue. Uh, sit away confirmation of the readiness and undertake the rescue mission. Okay. Uh, I'll go your preference thing and we'll leave as soon as you're ready. Don't tell me it's Alpha now. Mama, you came! I, uh, I thought I'd give you all a roar and send off. Tis the least I can do for the fine men and women we're about to make a lifelong wish come true. Well, we'll do our best. It occurs to me that for all the help you've afforded us, we know little, uh, we know little and less about you. What do the Empire do to earn your ire? Uh, ah, but I fear the curiosity is before consideration. I quite understand if you'd rather not relive those moments. Uh, no, 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 I don't mind. Really. Truth be told, part of me it was itching to tell you my tale, mind you. It is hardly a novel. Uh, I ain't the first to serve at Imperial hands. Like most folk, I used to have a mother, she was sweet, caring woman with a uh, smile never far from her face. There was a sister too, a uh, pretty little thing. She uh, was gentle as lamb, but tough as nails. We were poor folk living on, living simple lives, uh, but we knew happiness just the same. And uh, then the Imperials came and took it all away. When little Amigo fell, they put my family to camp. Being a lad, I was made to do hard labor, uh, while my mother and sister were forced to do far worse. They hid their suffering from me as best they could, but I knew, uh, knew in the thought of it made me mad. We had to escape, so I had to plan to get us, out of the, get us out of the city. We were picking our way through the gorge and far outside the walls when they uh, caught up with us, and rather than allow, allow themselves to be taken in, my mother and sister peeked over the edge, and for my very ears, heartbroken as I was, I didn't put up a fight when the Imperials clapped me in chains and dragged me back. Trust me years that, that I, after I escaped again that time, I got away. That's so where I'd get revenge in the end. And I uh, became an adventurer, so I was uh, home my skills and learned uh, earn the coin I needed, but nigh on two decades since gone. Uh, and what have I achieved? Bugger all, that's what. Fucking bugger all, that's what. Not like you lot. Uh, you, ain't, you ain't been here ten minutes and you've already done more than I managed in ten bloody years. You go, it's too much credit, Glamont. Uh, we only seek to rescue our friends. Well, what's more important than that? Any, and in your road, uh, if you got your friends back, you go and plan on after the Empire, and don't pretend you ain't. I've helped fo uh, folks take on Imperials over the years, on it, and every time I, I have, I've helped stave off the appetite for revenge. But Simet tells me I won't be going hungry for a while with, with everything you've got planned. Uh, and you're sure that will satisfy you if you wish to strike back at the Empire with your own hand, you need only say the word. We'll gladly have you with us. Hampton, though the offer is, I fear I must decline. Uh, I swear to get revenge on the Empire. It's true, I've waited long realized. Uh, the front lines are no place for a man like me. Uh, there's something we, uh, some of us call Kraven, but I prefer to think of myself as a realist. Uh, my talent lies in scheming, you see, not swordplay. 
uh, helping you, f uh, helping folk like you, is how it can make the most difference. Well, that's quite enough storytelling for one day. Best not keep your friends waiting any longer. I'll be praying for your safety and success. May Rhaegar give you strength. Where, uh, where the Empire goes, misery is uh, terribly falls in its wake. Thank you all who call Orgy a home. We must end, uh, put an end to guys' ambitions. First, we have friends to rescue. Biggs of Wedge and I will lie and wait in Castle Center just outside the stronghold's uh, patrol perimeter. Uh, notice when you're ready. Oh, and don't forget you're aware your disguise or this will be a short rescue mission in history. Shortest rescue mission in history, right. Okay. Off we go. Okay. Now we're going faster for some weird reason, but okay. I'll take it. I will most definitely take it. First gotta get rid of this thing. Okay. All right, let's talk to Sid. Let's, we got the magic tech armor. We're ready for rescue. Let's do it. As soon as my health reloads. Okay, let's do it. Forgive me for saying, uh, but you could quite a dash in Imperial, in Imperial Black and Crimson. Ah, now's not the time for Jess. Okay. Let's review the different solution from playing cast It's just beyond. Okay, short sure, while going over the patrol left to do its round. To do its rounds. Uh, Alpha and I will create a diversion. Out here and keep them occupied for as long as we're able. Uh, meanwhile, the three of you will enter the stronghold, posing as patrol, return from duty. Should Alpha know and I prove less distracting than hoped, I will contact you via Link Pearl. Be ready for a hasty, be a hasty retreat. Okay. And he sticks to landing! <laughs> Wedge will lead the way in, in the Reaper. Stay close to him. Uh, I didn't even tell you this, but don't do anything suspicious. Uh, 
Oh, unless you wonder, you and your soul uh, left shortly before you arrived. Uh, we had planned to. We had planned that they uh, should linger in the vicinity to cover our retreat in the event that Alphano and I attracted too much attention. But the, re the approach is, uh, of an Imperial vehicle forces to uh, Don't be too disappointed. They did at least leave a message for you and said, uh, Don't do anything reckless if memory serves me. Uh, wise words. Uh, all right, I'm uh, the Imperial Patrol should be returning any moment now. You best be off. Uh, good luck, Tiny. The Twelve keep you. Okay. Off to do our patrol. Okay. Okay, here we go. Ugh. You have spirit. That I will allow. Yet you struggle to the benefit of none. Least of all, yourself. The assassin, uh, Junius. This echo of yours intrigues us. We desire only to understand it, and for that, we need your help. You wish to be rid of the icons, do you not? You would have saved yourself a great deal of torment, had you accepted our aid from the beginning. Oh! Oh! Never slap a blonde woman, never kick her in the stomach! Tell me everything, and I shall end it quickly. Refuse, and though you beg for death, you shall not have it. Which will it be? As you wish, my dear Minfilia. Unpleasant though it will be for all concerned, you leave us no choice but to employ more rigorous methods of study. Be so kind as to deliver the prisoners to Castrum Meridiana. Okay. Yes, my lady. Oh. <sighs> oh no, no, never. Ah, that's beating a yeah, person like that, especially women. Just ugh. gives me great. Uh, doesn't sit well with me. Uh, oh, my apologies, I didn't notice you there. So engrossed uh, was I in my task, you'd be engrossed too. Uh, had the tribunus commanded uh, community to arrange that prisoners were transport be transported. What prisoners do I speak of? You mean the uh, one you haven't heard? Only the uh, famous Science of the Seventh Dawn, captured by uh, Tribunus herself. Uh, if you don't believe me, have a look in the storage tower next to you. Pass, pass that way. That's a fine salute. Uh, part of the maintenance crew from uh, Ossidians. How are you? Welcome to Castle Century Engineer. What prisoners? Oh, you've heard the rumors then. Yes, uh, they were being held in the storage tower, but that's not shit. They pay them no mind. Uh, you were summoned here to work, not Gopinators, as defeated heroes. Now, uh, show a bit of enthusiasm and I'll have your report. Okay. I have to go over here, I think. Yeah. Okay. Greetings, comrade. Forgive me for asking, but you haven't visited the store show recently, have you? I only ask that I drop something in there. And, um, oh, who am I fooling? I've fallen for one of the prisoners. Alright. I dare say, uh, you know what I, you know the one I mean. 
the svelte blonde. Goodness no. Uh, that's the law. Oh, Philan uh, laughs. Uh, I was bit with. She's so adorable it hurts. I don't want to sweep her off my arms and squeeze her to my uh, arms ache. Oh. Do you reckon it would take me to convince uh, this in turn to leave me the key so I, I can see her? Okay. Okay. What's this? You need access to the source. Show what business do you have there? Uh, the tri at the tribunal's behest, you say? Uh, this is highly irregular, but it would not do to make the uh, lady wroth. Take my identification key and see that it is returned when you're air Okay. Security's tight, just to use the group, you're gonna need a special key for me. That's the bulkhead. Okay, don't worry, I got the key. Okay. Okay, here we go. Damn in the steel door. Okay. We got a big fight on our hands coming up. <laughs> no! I'm truly in the rest. Thank goodness they're safe. Uh, I'm the one you want. Leave the others be. Uh, if you harm my friends, I swear I'll take my life and you shall answer to your mistress. Oh, they got Uriange too. Okay. 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 Alright, we must do something. We risk letting the cast room since you know we're here. Ah, uh, you're right. We have a better chance. Never get a better chance. This is third squadron. What is it? Reaper seized when, and this came to light only now. The culvert uh, will have left a trail. Take as many men as you need to scour the area. I want that reaper found now. Another chance. What the? Strike my last. Uh, eliminate the intruders. You're gonna die, clown.
Let's see those danger puddles. Damn it. What the shit? Okay. No, I don't want it. No, what the what the heck? Do I have to do this all over again? Uh... Skip cutscene? Yes. Okay, good. Okay, that was a fluke last time. That was a definite fluke. Remember Tiny? I was... <laughs> Tiny? He was so scared! <laughs> it's okay, honey. <laughs> it was foolish of you to come here. Uh, you might have been killed, uh, but thank you. I sure think what might have happened had you not uh, arrived when you did. I say, uh, did you not see Thancred anywhere? I'm beginning to fear the, uh, fear the fellow. Fear for the fellow. Uh, doing your hair shall yield us no answer. Let us away and eh, air the window to our liberty. Lost us, yeah. Okay. Uh, what did you say? Escaped? Uh, then recapture them. Phelan shall have your head. And what do we have here? Check fight! Chabinus yourself, just as he, uh, just as he said. You have the uh, eye of the uh, Aram and... Ida. <laughs> All right, recent chick fight. Well, she's kind of hard to miss with that showy armor of hers. Curse the science! How dare you slip our defenses? Uh, with unexpected ease, if truth be told, uh, 
there chanced to be a commotion outside the castrum walls, which allowed us to, which allowed us to veil ourselves the comforts of your vehicle. You still just, you still just being polite. That was the most uncomfortable things I've ever stowed away, and it's no wonder they call them, call it the Phantom Train. Uh, haha, <laughs> Phantom Train. That's a Final Fantasy VI reference. Uh, Patrick would have been uh, seen dead on it. So you're just gonna miss the freight, uh, like the vermin you are. I shall be sure to have words uh, with our rat catcher. Such negligence is unforgivable. Unforgivable! Uh, that is far from your pressing concern. First, you must answer for your own wrongdoing, uh, Olivia. It's genius. It was you who led the raid on the waking sands. Uh, you who butchered but unarmed men and women for the crime of being unworthy of capture. Uh, you killed our friends, we'll never forgive you! Uh, no, uh, we suffer the, uh, the you to plague, uh, here is your day longer. Uh, take you and your guard. Four intruders, protect the tribunus. Uh, confound it! Eat it with me! Run! After them! Now! Uh, Sheffield. Uh, why did the voice acting budget stop? Um... Oh, the, uh... How you doing, Schofield, by the way? Um, the low-budget voice acting, um... Is only for certain cutscenes. So... It, it'll, it'll, it'll be... It'll be only for certain cutscenes, and it'll it'll be out of uh, yeah. It's only for certain cutscenes. Where is His Excellency? In the hangar, my lady. In discussion with our guest. Load him at once. Yes, my lady. But don't worry. It's it's here and there. No! 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 There they are. Fan out and surround them. Let's protect your tower, Biggs. I'm going in. See everyone to safety. Okay. Uh, that is why you don't hire the most expensive voice talents. Yeah. Don't worry. It, the 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 voice talent gets better in the DLCs. No wedge, don't do it! Oh crap, here we go. Also, every footstep sounds the same, yeah. Food step? You mean footstep, not food step. I'll tell you, hold him off. Uh, I'll look after him and feel him to Taru. Okay. Mech fight! We got a big giant mech fight. Yes, uh, footsteps, sorry, yeah. Okay. 
How come this thing will, will not die? I don't get it. Why is this thing not going down? Yeah, what the heck? Probably why. Okay, now it's going down. Okay. Got it! Oh, shit. Where the field- where's the field generator at? Oh, over there. Okay. Yep, okay, there we go. Now we can fight them off. Where's the field generator for that, for this one? Aha! Here it is. Yep, 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 
Okay, let's get back and destroy that. Other way, other way. No! John boy. <laughs> More like colossal waste of iron. All right, we got him. Yeah. Duty complete. Let's get our butts out of here. Great, more soldiers. Come on, we gotta get out of here. Well, great. Take the leader, kill the rest. Here's a voice cutscene. What the? The Astola! Pray, forgive us our delay. That Papa chick knows Lina. how to fight. Minfilia. Ida! What took you so long? Well, it's nice to see you too. The reunion must wait. Right. First things first. Yes. Let's get back to being heavily outnumbered. <laughs> you ditched your Magitek armor. Fool of a Lalafell. <laughs> oh, you be Irish now. You big strong man, you be Irish. There's no one in there. This is Sid. Can you hear me? I need you to count to five, then jump. Understood?
One. Two. Three. Four. Ah, uh, the old jump off the cliff and get picked up trick. Yep. That always works! I know not which is more pitiful. The charlatans who rule Eorzea. It sounds like he's speaking through a can. Or the masses that clamor for their implausible panaceas. How did they land inside of it? <laughs> Beats me, I don't know. I see that which they cannot. This realm founders for want of a ruler with true power. The power to cast down icons. If you continue to deny this truth, it is the people who will suffer. Embrace reason. Oh yeah, embrace your reason, not mine. Yeah, okay. Yeah, your your reason is is you know oppressing. Does sound like he's literally phoning it in. Yeah, it's like it's like he's speaking through like a can or something. It's got like a microphone and a can. What in the seven hells? Oh no. It's here. Is guy talking to anyone or just having a monologue? Just having a monologue, yeah. Twelve preserve us. They finished it. Ultima weapon. So it has a name. It is a relic of ancient Alag. Excavated from its resting place deep beneath Alamigo. The Alagans used it to crush primal and foe alike. And now the Garleans mean to do the same. Guess what? We have to fight that thing later on, I, I bet. I bet. I bet we have to fight that thing. Damn you, Gaius. Look! There! Beside the Black Wolf! An Assian. Yes, an Assian. He's full of ass. He literally is an ass. An overlord, no less. His garb attests to that. La Habrea. It could only be him. No. Thancred! It's Thancred! Should be able to take he it out. Was yeah. La Habrea? No. No, this cannot be! We have to go now! Hang on! Thancred! No! <laughs> wow! She phoned that in. And... I think he's being mind-controlled. How can she hear anyone from that distance? Yeah. All that time... The enemy was beside me, and I never even suspected. Huh. The person who's voicing Alphano right now is Sam Regal from Critical Role, by the way. Uh, they change voice actors in, in, he in uh, the DLC, uh, the next, uh, the, the first DLC, uh, Heaven's Word. Uh, yeah, the voice acting is so much better in Heaven's Word and Stormblood, uh, Shadow, uh, um, yeah, um, Heaven's Word, it, 
Heavensward, Stormblood, uh, Shadow Something, and Endwalker. Yeah, those are the DLCs. And to think that it was I who suggested that Thancred investigate the Asians. <sighs> How could I have been so blind? Yeah. Small wonder the enemy knew our every move and where to find us. <sighs> Confound it all! <sighs> no. No, this is not the time for self-doubt. The Alliance leaders stake their hopes on the Scions, but now they believe us all dead or missing. When they learn of the Empire's new weapon, we cannot be certain what they will do. We must go and offer them what assurances we can that defeat is not inevitable. Cryo? This is Minfilia. The situation may have taken an ill turn. Forgive me if I seem brusque. The item but I the battle is far from is over, and so long as we Wonderful. stand together, I'm there shall ever be hope of victory. Urgently. How soon can it be delivered? The people of Eorzea falter for want of such hope. Your debt, Let friend. us provide it. Let us bear to them the tidings that the Scions of the Seventh Dawn are returned. Matters are coming to a head. I hope we can count on you. My regards to Grandfather. I am ready. Let us pay a visit to the Council of the Alliance leadership. Let me tell you. Uh, I guess it sounds like he's, he's like he's going to die. Yeah, he. Sam Regal's a good voice actor, but he and in, in this in this in this instant, he really like threw all into it and it just sounded really bad. I like the head uh, I like the head nodding, it's good replacement for useless dialogue, yeah. How's the black wolf and his new toy? Rally all available for some out. I want them ready to move on my word. And really to uh, plaster in order to sail, that is all. And the mail ship stands ready. What are the flames? Ready as we're like to be. I only give the word uh, the real. Has there been no word from Ishgard? Uh, none. The dragons have got their tongues. Mm, Silent to the last. I was unwise to hope for better. What was Sir the Archbishop to open his holy mouth if not this? Eh, and he claims the fury for his god. Tis bad comedy. Uh, Ravon looks like a looks like he's out of place, like he's a basketball player or uh, a football player. Yeah, he's big and sturdy, but he, he's ba he's basically a, uh, a bodyguard. The Holy See has made his choice. We will proceed without co uh, its cooperation. We were all acquainted with the terms of the Black Wolves ultimatum. We must agree on a, port, uh, on a course of action, not less than the fate of Aeorus, he hangs upon the decision of this council. Van Belsar claims to wield the power of the uh, Fight Primals. 
Should we yield him, uh, he pledges uh, to the realm of false gods, yet offer resistance, and he swears we shall uh, share the primal's fate. Pardon, pardon me my bluntness, but I, uh, I like not these choices. Uh, that is too great a decision for any of our nations to make alone. Choose who surrender or resistance, we must answer as one. Uh, for if but one surrenders, the rest uh, surely shall fail us. Pray for the wisdom to do right by our all our peoples. All right. Speak with Minfilia. Oh, here they are. They're loaded in. Okay. Okay. Uh, once people are able to learn that the scientists have not returned, they will surely rally to our cause. Uh, we need only uh, on the clarion call. Is it only flower burns? You need the heavens village for you to. Oh, honey, I hope my singing doesn't bother you. I'm rather fond of this little ditty of home. Okay, what do the others have to say? Let's see. Uh, what do you think? I mean, was she impressed? Do you think she might consider, you know? Okay. No. Tara is her own person. That was all like, so things to play out. Plus, we escaped with our lives. Uh, sorry, we had resources just to end this escape. Things escalated quickly. That alpha that I saw no other alternative. <sighs> okay. Sorry. Okay, now we can speak to him. Uh, Thangrid's um, plight troubles us all. We cannot allow anything to come between us and our goal. So as long as the ultimate weapon is Aorzea, we'll never know peace. Uh, let us, uh, let's go to the Alliance Leader Center and help them make the right decision. Okay. That was it? Okay. Uh... Amphelia is, is greatly concerned by the recent developments concerning the Council of the Alliance Leaders. Uh, Grim Tidings Tiny, it seems the word of the ultimate weapons exists has already reached the Alliance leaders in the form of the ultimatum. They have gathered in the fragrant chamber and are delivering their answers. Uh, beleaguered as they are, I fear uh, they may elect to lay down their arms, leave and surrender. Bear their people suffering, yet nothing could be further from the truth. Hmm. <coughs> That which the Black uh, Wolf offers will do mayors and not deliver it, and the leaders must be made aware of this. Let us hurry to them, Tiny, so that they do not act in ignorance of the, ignorance of the consequences. Elevator. Steps of the fall. Okay. Yeah. Uh -huh. 
Oops. Gladiators Guild, yeah, let's go there. Okay, uh... Let's see, our quarry is... That's right, up here. Okay. Over this way. Okay, yep, over here. Uh these maps look huge. Yes, they are they are very confusing. Gotta talk to this guy. Uh, the council of the last leaders for the progress in the first case, case, step away from the door, sir. I'm sorry, you're here on behalf of the science of the Senate, done. A thousand parts, my lord. Of course, you may enter. Yep. Okay. Ah, we keep treading the same ground. Okay. Hang on one second. Okay. Van Belsar's demands are clear. Alas, our minds are not. I've never been one to shy from a fight, but if this weapon of theirs can do all they claim... It has been five years since the Calamity, and our people have scarce begun to rebuild their lives. Can we now, in good conscience, call upon them to risk what little they have left? I would spare them the pain of further conflict. Conflict, I say, though that would imply forces set in opposition. If the combined might of three primals could not stay Garlemald's new terror, what meaningful resistance can we offer? We who struggle to quell the foes who rise up within our own borders. Long have we fought the primals, but to what end? We strike them down at no small cost. Only for them to rise again and again. Are we to play this profitless game for the rest of days? I, for one, grow tired of it. Mistake me not. I do not propose to trade one tyranny for another. I love liberty. But conciliation need not mean oppression. By the Twelve. Though neither of you cried surrender, your every word betokened it. <sighs> Not that I deny there is truth in what you say, nor can I rightly claim that Ulda is ready to fight. Refugees flood our gates, and beastmen swarm our land, while the great and the good do nothing. My flames struggle to bear the burden. I put on a grand show at the Remembrance Service, made all manner of lofty promises. I've made good on not a bloody one. Do not blame yourself, Raubon. You said only that which the people needed to hear. All present have done the same. Our citizens had become lost to hope. If our words serve to kindle it in them anew, Better we speak than remain silent. Our enemy condemns us for failing our people. Yet what does he care for their well-being? While we labored to rebuild their lives, the Black Wolf built instruments of murder with which to end them. 
Her Majesty speaks true. For all our failings, the people's well-being has ever been our foremost priority. While none among us ever doubted that the Empire would one day resume its war, we scarcely had means enough to solve the problems of the present. Aye, which is why we look to others to safeguard our future. Mm. These are the worst political arguments I've ever heard. Yeah, trust me, uh, the DLC, uh, Heaven's Word, and, and the, others, the others beyond that, um, they're far much better. Uh, in terms of dialogue and voice. The scions of the seventh dawn. Alas, they are gone. And the black wolf is at our door. Admiral! I fear you are mistaken. Alphinord? Minfilia? And seven hells! Master Garland? Are they trying to replace plumbing or adding a uh, or adding a stop sign? Uh, <laughs> beats me, man. Um, no, they're they're trying they're trying to stop um, they're trying to stop the Ultima weapon from being used on Aorzia and its people. And you, dear friend. By Ralga, you're alive. All of you. As we approached, I would swear I heard talk of surrender. But I know that cannot be. It is not the Eorzean way. Hear me, my friends. Accepting the Gallians' offer to vanquish the Primals would be folly. Folly, I say. For might is not the answer to the Primal threat. Indeed, the more the Empire exerts its strength, the worse matters will become. Primals enter this world when mortals call upon them, and mortals are wont to appeal to a higher power when they are desperate. Nothing is more certain to breed desperation in the beast tribes than the Gallians' proposed solution. The true answer lies in a lasting peace. But the Garlians only know war and conquest. Should Eorzea fall into their hands, there will be such suffering as none can imagine. We are not blind to the many challenges that each of your nations face. Yet you must not give in. Uh, the cameraman knows how to dig us that outfit. Yeah. Uninfilia is. Yeah. I remember five years ago when you wagered all for the sake of the realm. Remember what you fought for, what you were willing to die for. Let the memories rekindle the fire in your heart, for Eorzea has need of it again. Come what may, we Scions will never give up the fight. And so I bid you stand with us, and together we shall safeguard the future of the realm. A great man once said that a shrewd merchant grasps not for the quick profit, but invests in the future. Wise words, eh, Raban? Sid, I... Uh... Your words stir and shame me in equal measure. How could I contemplate surrender? I know full well that all we have, we owe to the sacrifices of those who went before us. Yet the seeming hopelessness of our plight robbed me of my insight. We Gridanians have no love for war, yet we have still less for those who would threaten our homeland. Ever have we fought to protect those things we hold dear, and this shall never change. 
It is English and not English at the same time. Yeah. True. Gridania will go to war. We will fight the Empire. For the sake of the realm and all who abide here. <laughs> okay, that was uncalled for. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> that creeped me out. That's creepy voice lines. I keep saying the same thing over and over again. We don't like war. But the guys we don't like, they do like war. Yep, exactly. Exactly. This this the base game needed a, a needed a lot of retuning but um here's the thing though about about this game when it originally came out it was a completely different story and then people didn't like the game so what they did was players were uh were protesting the game inside the game and then a year later they redid the whole game and it be and it, be, it came to this so yeah these people are insane, uh, terrible rules, and sadistic, though they laugh uh, when they declare war. <laughs> At long last, I hear words worthy of a founder of the Alliance. Uh, I, I have a little video I could send you uh, of what the game was originally like. And let me tell you, the the original incarnation of this game was terrible. And then they then they redid it, and it became this. And then the then the DLC after then the DLC packs after this were so much better. And if if you would if people would want me to, I will do Heaven's Word, uh, the first DLC. Well, Bon, are we to be all done? I lost one homeland. The thought of losing another had blunted my resolve. But no man knows better than I that if you want aught, you'd best be ready to die for it. Hey, uh, games are unusually terrible when it comes to writing like this because the writers don't the writers don't live in reality, right? And they. They have, they have such a loss of imagination as well. With great danger comes the chance for great glory and great profit. We all dons who have turned sand into gold know this well. How many times have we fallen into the pit of despair only to have you pluck us out? I've fair lost count. Reckless, the lot of you, like bloody pirates. Well, I won't waste my breath trying to talk you round, on account of being a pirate myself. And the pirate who shrinks from a challenge is no pirate at all. Those who would pick a quarrel with us must choose. Back down, or go down with all hands. Let the Garleans come. The united strength of Limsa Lominsa. We'll be <coughs> waiting for them. If our realm is to be free of this pall of darkness, let it be by our own hands. <laughs> no, you don't want it by your own hands. Trust me. For Eorzea! That old uh, we part is this that cliche? How yeah. The weapon may be brought to bear against us. The maelstrom will secure strategic points along the coastline. In the meantime, the flames will deploy at. 
Be at ease, my friends. You have banished our doubts. Yeah. Nanamo is, is also a bad voice actress as well. Uh, she's not the worst out of the whole out of the whole group, but trust me, again, the DLC gets a lot better. Pray, leave the military matters to us, and retire to the waking sands. We will send word anon. Also, the lip sync, uh, the the lip sync is off in this, and it's fixed. <laughs> It is completely fixed in the DLC. Trust me. Okay. Alright, we got more... Uh... Vesper Bay tickets. Okay, yep. So, alright. Let us return to the... Uh, pray return to the Waking Sands, and we'll, uh... We'll turn in a request, and we'll call, we'll call it a uh, stream. I cannot well express my relief to think that the Alliance came so close to surrender. But the fire in their hearts has been rekindled, and they will fight to the last. This warmth inside. Did you feel it too, Grandfather? I would know something. Was that your power at work earlier? Nothing of the sort. The leaders of Eorzea had lost their way. I merely helped them to find it again. Oh, hello. Yes, our party returned just a moment ago. How close are you? That's not Bluetooth. They call it Link Pearl, even though it acts like Bluetooth. It's all right, Sid. We must needs plan our next move. Pray continue liaising with your respective nations. Sid, would you be our man in Ulda? I'll be whatever and wherever you need me to be. We haven't a moment to waste. All right, let's do this. Sankrid's fate weighs heavy on my mind. I cannot bear to think of him enthralled to an Asian. Mayhap you know this already, but the Asians are immortal beings without physical form. Since time immemorial, they have fanned the flames of chaos from the shadows. That they might work unseen, the Asians entrap and possess mortal men by means of malign artifacts known as Crystals of Darkness. One such crystal may yet be the key to saving Thancred. This is a crystal of darkness. A mere replica, created using data obtained from anomalous crystals found across Eorzea. It comes to us courtesy of the students of Baldessian, our distant allies. Even for an Archon, Thancred's talents are exceptional. We all had complete confidence in him. It was for this reason that none among us foresaw the danger in sending him to investigate the Asians alone. Thancred had been striving to fill the void left by Louis Soir. Yet, it was plain that he was overtaxing himself. Yeah, he would volunteer for everything 
and worked till he was dizzy. And the toll taken by his exertions made him vulnerable to Asian influence. The crystal that binds Thancred must be somewhere on his person. If we could but destroy it, his Asian possessor would be compelled to relinquish control over him. You have proven the stoutest of allies, standing with us through thick and thin. Yet the most perilous struggle is still to come. For the sake of the realm, and Thancred, I ask that you lend us your strength once more. Of course. Thank you. From the bottom of my heart. As I am sure you are aware, the realm was saved from certain doom five years ago by heroes known as the Warriors of Light. Again, that is a reference to Final Fantasy I. What you may not be aware of is that your many feats in service to the Scions have prompted folk to make certain... comparisons. I must confess, you do remind me of them. Yet, remember this. However glorious the past, it is the hero's lot to be judged on the deeds of the present. A new darkness threatens the realm, and the people cry out for a savior. <laughs> Warriors of Light trademarked, yep. Yeah, the Warriors of Light, um... Uh, in Final Fantasy 1, that, that was your... That was your, uh... Your adventuring party that you started, you know the, uh, you know fighter, white mage, red mage, blue, uh, black mage, uh, thief, and black belt. Yeah, those were those were your adventuring part, uh, adventuring party that you could choose from. Four that you could choose from, and if you ever read the the web comic nu uh, Nuclear Power, um, they took uh, that comic took sprites and put Final Fantasy. In, in a funny light where they had all the uh, all the warriors of light characters uh, come in, you know, and do do funny comic strips, and it was about as funny as you know as, uh, as the you know the com you know, the the Sunday you know, or the newspaper funnies. Is he still making nuclear power? I don't know. Uh, look it up. I believe that you are he. A warrior of light, here in the present, guided by the crystal's will. Come, my friends. Let us fight to safeguard the future of our beloved Eorzea. Okay. Complete. Black Wolf's ultimatum. Okay. Wow. Huh. Oh. Oh, I have to get to next level. Okay. Okay, yeah, we're gonna call it there, and um, yeah, I'll 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 get I'll get to the next level easily by doing some side quests. So yeah, um, or I'll you know I'll just I'll just run some duties, or uh, I'll I'll run a dungeon or two and get get to the next level. So yeah, um, all right. So again, thank you for joining me, and we will see. Uh, Ape, Ape Bit Theater ended in 2010. We are old, very old, yeah. Wow, 2010, dang. Okay. Yeah. <laughs> thanks for the stream. Yeah, no problem. Thanks for coming, uh, thanks for coming on and chatting with me and keeping me company. And thank you for all the lurkers coming in. And, you know, we had about four or five people, so... Yeah, that was good. Um, 
Yeah, as for as for next week, um I don't know what's gonna go on. Um I uh the stream ruiner, yeah. Uh I like your beard by the way. Thank you. Um like I said, I, I know not what's going on. I did a I did a job interview today. So we'll find out next week if I have if I have the job or not, or if I have to do another interview uh, with the people. So um, that may, uh, if I do get the job, I may have to alter my stream uh, schedule. Um, but as of as of this week, um, Sunday this Sunday we are doing Jackbox, and yeah. So we'll find out what's going to go on next week if I get the job or not. And we'll see what happens. So I may alter my stream for for weekends, or I may put stream stream on hold until uh, until I no, can no longer work that job, or I just may have to quit entirely. So we'll find out. Mm, I hope you get the job. Yes, I I hope I get the job too, and I hope I can still stream. So, yeah. Um all right. So, let's let's go raid somebody just just for the heck of it, just to, just to make somebody feel better. Uh okay, let's If you stick with me here, we'll, we're going to raid somebody. Uh Okay, we're we're gonna uh we're gonna raid my buddy uh Proto Dino. Uh so yeah. Okay. Uh my, my buddy Proto Dino, he's playing uh Escape from Tarkov, so go give him a follow and um yeah, go watch him play Tarkov. It's really good. Everybody see you later, and see you Sunday for Jackbox. Bye-bye.